pressurization. And this air is conditioned, so we can keep folks cool on the ground for hot summer days like today, and heated at high altitudes where things get a little bit cooler to keep the pilots and the passengers comfortable. There they are again, just moments away at this point. It's looking like we're about four minutes and 20 seconds out now. We're about two minutes out now, and once we get to the 30-second point, Spaceship Unity is gonna arm the launch pylon. Five, three, two, one. Release, release, release. Clean release. Ignition. Good rocket motor burn. There's Mach 1 trimming now. Trim complete. Unity is pointed directly up and heading to space. Things are looking great. We are 25 seconds into the burn now, approaching Mach 2. 50 seconds approaching Mach 3. There's Mach 3. The pilots are now unlocking the feather, and um, as soon as they do that, it's going to initiate a backflip for Spaceship Unity. This is normal. We want those windows pointed down towards the Earth to maximize that incredible view. And for the non-pilots tuning in, those numbers represent the first two numbers of the magnetic heading of the runway. So for example, 3-4 is 340 degrees on your compass. We are just about a thousand feet above the field now and on final. 500 feet above the runway. Main gear touchdown. And we're going to hold it just like this for a minute before bringing the nose down. Can see they're already celebrating inside there. And the nose is coming down now. Nose gear touchdown. And braking. that incredible drone footage here as we come in. And there is full stop. All right. A perfect landing. Virgin Galactic has just broken through the commercial space from our operational home base, Spaceport America. A beautiful day of flight. What a moment. Congratulations to everybody on board and, of course, our very own Spaceship Unity who returned to space today. And, of course, we also saw beautiful flying from our EVE crew, CJ and Kelly, and brilliant work by our chase pilots, Jamil and Patrick, all of whom are still in the air right now. Great job to you all.